50 Michael Jordan Sports Illustrated covers in 50 days. I'm doing a video on each cover going from 50 all the way to number one. So kind of reverse chronological order here, starting with the newest ones. And then the first cover, obviously, is his oldest one. Uh, today is cover number 48. So this was released on January 14th, 2002. This is Jordan's third cover when he played with the Wizards. Still just looks weird. Every time I see this, uh, this issue or any of the issues where he played for the Wizards, just looks really odd to have Jordan wearing that Wizards uniform. However, I, I do like that um, Othella Harrington right there, totally getting posterized. The guy looks like he was just pushed off a cliff. Um, yeah, and that's, I mean, so many Jordan covers and posters. I mean, that's why they had the term for it. They called it posterized back in the day. And Othello Harrington looking pretty rough there. Um, by this time when this issue came out, Jordan was 39. He still averaged 23 points a game in this 2002 season. Six rebounds, five assists on an absolutely atrocious Wizards team. Um, they only scored, uh, only won 31 games that year. Uh, led the Wizards in scoring that year. Uh, it was actually just four assists away from leading in total assists for the season. Not four a game, but four assists um, for leading the team in assists. So still really at the top of his game. Um, my favorite Jordan stat this year, this 20, uh, 2002 year, was his pay. So remember, he was a part owner of the Wizards, sold his ownership stake to go back and play for the team. He only made a million dollars this year, ranked 17th on the team as far as payroll is concerned. Another really cool story is this, um, you know, again, 2002 is when this issue came out. Jo Jordan donated his entire salary to 9-11 relief efforts. So I think that was pretty cool. Um, just a month before this issue came out, he dropped 51 against the Hornets to be the oldest player ever to score 50 points in a game. Um, after the uh, 2003 season, of course, you know, obviously Chicago retired his number 23 Jer Jordan uh, jersey. What I, another story that I love about this, the Miami Heat also retired number 23 for Jordan, a team he's never played for. Um, and that's one of the reasons why when LeBron went from Cleveland to play for the Heat, uh, he changed his number in 2010 because Jordan's number 23 had been retired from the Heat. I don't know. I've never heard of that before. I think I did some research on this. I couldn't find any other example of a team retiring somebody's jersey when that player never played for that team. So I love that story. Uh, follow me on Facebook, uh, Twitter, Instagram, TikTok, eBay. It's all the same thing everywhere. CGC Sports Illustrated and cover number 47 is coming up in the next video.